Knoxville, Tennessee, inside of Thompson Bowling Arena. We're ready to go in game two of the Rocky Top Classic. It's the OA team this afternoon, the Norfolk State Lady Spartans taking on the Tennessee Lady Volunteers. Game two for each of the sides in this classic. Tennessee, a winner a night ago, a three sets to none win over New Hampshire and Norfolk State getting a thrilling five-set loss. And now to go to the Citadel. Both these squads will play one other match today. But we're ready to go here in day two of the Classic. I want to thank you all for joining us here on the SEC Network Plus. Be with you all afternoon again, as well as game number two. This evening, 6.30 match for Tennessee and the Citadel. And we're ready to go here in Rocky Top. Service down past the line and sent in. And point number one quickly goes to Tennessee after the kill from Cadence Booth. First to serve for Tennessee, it'll be number two, Natalie Hayward, the senior from Bothell, Washington. And across and Tennessee on the offensive end. Spiked down and killed. It's nine, it's number 19, Claudia Pollock, and Tennessee quickly ahead. It's two to nothing. Hayward to serve once again. She was a part of the 2021 All SEC team. A transfer from DePaul in 2020. Spike down, nice dug out by number two, Norfolk Stake. It's Nicole Rodriguez and the first point on the board for the Lady Spartans. Norfolk State head coach by Kathy Bullock in her fourth season as head coach of Norfolk State. 11 and 47 overall, 40, 29th season, excuse me, as a college head coach. Norfolk State comes in 0-5, looking for their first win here in 2022. Hayward will set it up and tipped over the net. And a nice play there by the Lady Vols. It's Erica Lovett, the sophomore from Newman, Georgia. Lovett has been a spark so far this season for the Lady Vols. 81 kills here in her sophomore campaign. This one sent down and away. And sent back. Lovett this time. Dug out nicely by Alondra Hernandez. Killed and a nice one there. This time it is number seven, Morgan Fingal. The senior from Fairfax, Virginia. Fingal, a breakout campaign in 2021, second in kills per set. She was a preseason All-SEC member here in 2022. Sent over, dug out nicely by the Lady Vols. Norfolk State looking for their second point. Nice rally going, a 4-1 set one lead for Tennessee, and that one's sent over here by our broadcast booth. And Norfolk State does get point number two indeed. Tennessee coming into this contest four and three overall. Kind of a disappointing start to the 2022 campaign. High expectations for this squad. Pick to finish third in the Southeastern Conference this season, just behind Kentucky and Florida. This one sent over and point for the Lady Vols. Once again, Erica Lovett, as you see her there on your screen. Lovett, a sophomore. Newman, Georgia, transfer from Long Beach State. Definitely an impact transfer for Eve Rackham Watt here in her fifth season on Rocky Top. 
It'll be the libero to send it over this time. It's Paolo Laborda. That one blocked nicely at the net. It's Fingal once again. Something, an interesting stat I saw in my research for this contest, Norfolk State, they do not have a player on their roster listed over six feet tall. Tennessee looking to take plenty of advantages there, and Fingal does a nice job on the block. Now in center over nicely, little tip pass across the net. And now Norfolk State will send Paola Matos back to serve. Matos from Puerto Rico, member of the Puerto Rican under-18 national team and was a freshman MEAC all-rookie. Set up by Hayward, sit down by Fingal and Point Tennessee. The Hayward to Fingal combination is one of the best ones all across the SEC. And you get a good replay here. Finding the gap in the defense. Point Tennessee, they're up early 7-3. Fingal will now serve for the Lady Vols. Sent across the neck. Nice job by Lovett keeping that alive, and Tennessee won't be able to send it back across. Nice kill, just Tennessee unable to get to the volleyball. As Hernandez and Carla Hernandez will send that one away. Hayward. Love it. And it's spiked down. Another nice job and another assist for Natalie Hayward. Love it with her third kill on the match. Great pop there. A total of 267 total assist. Keep our eye on her all afternoon. Some sent over and a free play for the Lady Vols. Ming a little tip, pancake block down on the hardwood, and the roll point, Tennessee. Fantastic hustle play there from Nicole Rodriguez. Really had to hustle in to get this one. There it is. What a beautiful replay there from my man Barrett Walker. Tennessee quickly up 9-4. Set up at the net. And a violation. Point Tennessee. Now Erica Lovett will get a chance to serve. We've seen her already with a couple of kills here in this one. This one's set up nicely. Blocked at the net. And that one a long, a little long there. Point Tennessee. Can't speak enough about Erica Lovett. True six rotation outside player. Second in Long Beach State from a year ago in kills per set. She actually led the Big West in 42 aces as she served there. Hayward. Tip pass Lovett again and Norfolk State with the possession. Blocked at the net. I believe that one just caught the top of the net. As Keandra Granberry was there. Beautiful look from our net cam. And yet, just unable to get it over the net. Tennessee with a quick 12 4 lead. Timeout on the floor.
back into Knoxville. Early 12 to four lead for the four and three Tennessee Lady Volunteers. Couple of nice serves already early from Erica Lovett. She'll serve once more after the quick timeout by Kathy Bullock and Norfolk State. Great look there of Eve Rackham-Watt in her fifth season at the helm here in Knoxville. 77 and 40 overall. Fourth winningest coach in program history. This one sent over and blocked at the net once more. We'll give the point to Norfolk State. And now it'll be at number 10, Paola Meriday to serve. This one heading over right in front of me. Tipped away and Norfolk State back-to-back -back points. Meriday to serve, the graduate from Sao Paulo, Brazil. This one's sent down by Booth, dug out nicely by Norfolk State. Lovett is there, and Booth once more. That one, point Norfolk State. Three straight from the Lady Spartans trying to creep their way back in this one. Who tipped over. Nice job there. Kind of faked him out. Natalie Hayward there on the offensive end. Perfect look from up top. Hayward looking to set. Nope. She'll just throw it over herself. Point Tennessee. Serving for the first time tonight. Jakiah Moore, the junior from Knightsdale, North Carolina. This one tried to be dug out by the libero, Nicole Rodriguez, unable to do so. And Tennessee answers the three straight points from Norfolk State quickly with two of their own. Nice job at the net. Claudia Pollock that time. Moore to serve once again. Pollock there again. She'll send this one over. Nope, that's Booth. And a nice job there. Just a little tip shot right over the net. It works to perfection for Tennessee and Cadence Booth. Just a little finesse. Just going to tip that one over right over the net. Tennessee with three straight. Cadence Booth, freshman, outside hitter from Kernsville, North Carolina. She was the player of the year in her high school conference three years in a row. Up top and killed down once again. Morgan Fingle climbing the ladder and just sending that down to the hardwood. Tennessee's starting to fill it here in set number one. They take their largest lead by nine points. Moore. Nice serve over the line. And that'll just have to be a sent over. Three point for Tennessee. And Hayward tried to get a little fancy with it. That one. They roll it in and point Norfolk State. New server for Norfolk State, Sydney McRae, the freshman from Durham, North Carolina. That one blocked at the net, but point Tennessee. Lady Vols, they can get off this hardwood and get some height up on their kills. Hayward back to serve for the Lady Vols. Short serve is a nice one and an ace for Hayward. This one just dies down right on the net. The libero, Nicole Rodriguez, not a whole lot she can do there. 
Tennessee quickly up 10 points in set number one. Another nice serve there. Rodriguez able to dig it out. Sit down by Norfolk State. And Tennessee will send it over. Rodriguez has been all over the place here for Norfolk State in the first set. Fingal and Point Tennessee. Tennessee, we mentioned a night ago, able to get the three sets to none win against New Hampshire. Went 25-12, 25-14, 25-12. As it looks like we're going to have a replay on the floor. Norfolk State a night ago in game one of the Rocky Top Classic. A two-set winner against the Citadel. Here is the play they're looking at. Trying to see who that was off of. I mentioned Norfolk State, game one, a two sets to three loss against the Citadel last night. 25, or 2025, excuse me, 25 22, 22 25, 15 to 25 and 15 13. Tennessee will get their chance at the Citadel this evening, and point for Tennessee as that replay is overturned. It'll be Tennessee and the Citadel, 6.30. It's when that match, match is set to get going underway. We'll have it right here for you on the SEC Network Plus. Hayward back to serve. And they roll that one in. Second ace of the afternoon for Natalie Hayward. Tennessee flexing early, a 20-8 to eight lead. Hayward, as I mentioned earlier, transfer from DePaul. Became the team captain here at Tennessee quite quickly, and that one blocked at the net. It is the combination of Fingal and number 19, Claudia Pollock. Good view from my net cam. Ooh, right into the face of number, t number seven. Morgan Fingal, so they will tend to Fingal. Fingal, a collegiate team USA player. Here goes senior Red, a senior from Fairfax, Virginia. As the athletic training staff checks on her. Looks like it got her just under the right nostril on her nose. I'll plug that up for her. Seems like she's good to go. They'll keep her out and we'll resume play. 21 to 8 Tennessee here in set number one. Fourth point in a row served from Hayward. That one sent over nicely and a nice job there by number eight for Norfolk Stake. It's Shante Seal, the transfer from Dakota College. Nice job here. I believe it got the left hand of Pollock. Caroms out of bounds. Norfolk State to serve. It'll be number 14, Alondra Hernandez. Nice dig backside by Norfolk State. Volleyball stays alive. Pollock this time, and it's good for Tennessee. Unable to be dug out by Hernandez backside for Norfolk State. Go, 
That one keeps it alive, and then Tennessee able to be awarded the point right here. Pollock sending it home. Backside dug out. Love it. And that one sent right into the net. She didn't like that one whatsoever. Norfolk State with the volleyball right back. And it'll be Kyla Hunter this time. Sophomore from Mesquite, Texas. And that's a service error right into the net. Tennessee, two points away from a set one win. Tennessee, they've been challenged so far this season. Wins against North Carolina State. Lost, though, to Colgate. After this contest, they will play three straight top 25 teams. Or, excuse me, teams that made the NCAA tournament a year ago. Western Kentucky on Tuesday night will be a top 25 team, but the Citadel this evening is not currently ranked in the top 25. McCray digs that out. Norfolk State with a chance for a point. That one stays alive sky high. And now Booth will send it back over. Norfolk State with an opportunity, and that one awarded to the Lady Spartans. Nice attempt there at the net by Emily Merrick for Tennessee. As it goes right off her hands and caroms out of bounds. Lady Spartans looking to hang around here in set number one. This one and right back. It's number 13, Emily Merrick. Merrick can't get the block, but she gets the kill here on point number 24 for Tennessee. One more point for the set one win. Right on cue, Merrick will serve. Helen dug out and out of bounds off of Merrick Point, Norfolk State. Great look here. Not set up, just sent right over by Sydney McCray, the freshman who head coach Kathy Bullock is really high on. Good nice so far here in set number one. Hayward across the court. Booth not there. And that one blocked down, and set one will go to Tennessee. Natalie Hayward with the block. Tennessee looking nice here in set number one. As you see, Hayward there set right back down. We'll go to set number two. Tennessee, a 25 to 12 set number one win.
Welcome back into Knoxville. Pleasure to be along with you for game number two of the day here in the Rocky Top Classic. Tennessee, a quick 25 to 12 set number one win. Teams will switch sides and we're ready to go here for set number two. Tennessee looking to improve to five and three with a big contest this afternoon coming against the Citadel. A couple of substitutions made as Keandre Granberry will check out for Tennessee. And Natalie Hayward will continue to serve for Tennessee. Sent up and over by Norfolk State. Dug out by Lovett. Sent over. And Norfolk State back on the offensive end. And that one spiked right into the ground by Shante Sill. Quick 1-0 lead and set two for Tennessee. That one, they roll it in, just sneaks in the back line from Hayward. Hayward with a nice ace there, just creeps in from the back line. She'll send this one away as well. And that one, sit down by Norfolk State. This time it's number six. Adeline DeFore. DeFore from Noonan, Georgia, a transfer from State College of Florida a year ago. Tennessee with an opportunity here, sent down, and another nice kill. Morgan Fingal once again, she's having herself an afternoon for the Lady Vols. Booth now to serve for Tennessee. Mentioned in our open, Norfolk State does not have a player listed over six feet tall. You look up and down this Tennessee roster and they've got plenty of them, but the height doesn't matter there as that one is sent to the deck by Carla Hernandez. Hernandez right at the net, sends that one down just out of the reach of Booth. But Tennessee, you look down this roster, they can go 6-1, 6-1, 6-4, 6-2, 6-6 is Pollock. A lot of height, and a lot of height they'll like to use in SEC play and miscommunication on the back end from Tennessee. Booth and Hayward couldn't figure out who wanted that one, and Norfolk State quickly ties up set number two at three apiece. Now Kyla Hunter will get to come in and serve for the first time from Mesquite, Texas. And quickly a point from the Lady Vols. Nice look of it here. I believe that was Hayward just sending it over, kind of deked out the Lady Spartan defenders. Now the libero to send it on for Tennessee. Paola Laborda. And that one sent out service error from Laborda. Paola a transfer from 2021 from Georgia Tech. She did have some really good experience in the NCAAs a year ago. She was put into that starting libero role, and she'll send this one back over. Hernandez sends this one, and point Norfolk State. They take their first lead of this matchup. Tennessee will huddle up and talk about it. Substitution made by head coach Eve rackham Watt. Ashlyn King checks in for Cadence Booth. King, sophomore from Murfreesboro, Tennessee. A talent from Blackman High School over in the Mid-State, four-time All-District player. And that one 
killed away. Number six that time, it's Erica Lovett. Lovett continues to have a fantastic match. Tennessee knots it right back up quickly. Tennessee a year ago, 20 and 10 overall, 11 and 7 in Southeastern Conference play. That was good for fourth in the SEC. 24th time they were 20, had a 20 win season. That one is sent over nicely across court from the Lady Spartans. That one chip pass. Out of the net. And a free ball here for Tennessee. Sit down and another kill once again. It's Granberry for her first kill on the afternoon. Granberry bumps it and kills it right back down. Tennessee quickly back in front. Tennessee a year ago, they did make their 16th NCAA tournament appearance all time, first since 2018. Looking to get right back to the NCAAs. That one just blocked right back down to the hardwood. Natalie Hayward once again. She two hands that right down to the deck. And now Morgan Fingal. Descended over from the kids in white. That one block right down. The libero, Nicole Hernandez, just gets that one over the net. Tennessee sends it right back across. Fingal to serve once more. That one sent over. Nice dug out there by Fingal. That one will stay in. Point Tennessee once again. Erica Lovett. Spoke highly of her already this contest. Noon it once again on the offensive end. Fingal now for her third. Serving a row. She'll send it over. That one tipped nicely. Nice dig out there by Laborda. Stays up. Sent over. Another block. This time Norfolk State. Tennessee will get the point. A flurry of action there on the point. Laborda sets it up. Uh, Sydney McRae couldn't keep that one on the right side of the net. Point Tennessee. Five straight points from the Lady Vols. Bingle and blocked straight down. Tennessee showing their height. Keandrea Granberry, the freshman from Winter Garden, Florida, showing off here in set number two. Tennessee on a quick 6 nothing run. They lead 11-5 here in set number two.
Back into Thompson Bowling Arena after the quick 6-0 burst of a run for the Lady Vols. Norfolk State takes a timeout. We're ready to, to rejoin you here in set number two. Mentioned Tennessee off to kind of a slow start here in 2022. Four and three overall. Key losses from a year ago. Brianna Reynolds, Lily Feltz, and Ava Bell. Tennessee just trying to find their identity here in 2022. As that one is a nice serve. It's Fingal once again. She is filling it over on the home side. Look at that filthy spin, and it's just sent back. Fingal has served the last seven points for Tennessee. Lady Vols, they welcome four transfers here in 22. Three freshmen on the roster this season. That one's sent over nicely, almost dug out by Fingal. But Point Norfolk State, it looked like it was number 18, Carla Hernandez, from her outside hitter position. Nice job there by Hernandez, and now she'll get to serve. Great stat there, 2.45 points per set for 18 in green, but a service error, and Tennessee will pick up the point. A little Tennessee history for you. First year of volleyball, 1958, the Squad approaching a thousand victories here. I'll have to win quite a few of them here. 968 as a school. I'll have to win a lot of them here in 2022 to reach that 1K feet as Norfolk State gets the point there. Five SEC regular season titles, four tourney titles, but looking to get either one for the first time since 2011. Love it. Digs it out. Sent over. Fingal. Pancake block on the deck. Tennessee gets the point. But a nice hustle on the defensive end from the Lady Spartans. They're trying to hang around here as the substitutions are made on both sides. Granberry and Labora check out for Tennessee. And Meriday out for Norfolk State. Tennessee doubling up the Lady Spartans here in set number two, 14 to seven. That one sent across, dug out again, love it once more, sent over and long. Dude sending that one just high and wide. Couple of more substitutions for Tennessee. Kaya Moore will check out for the Lady Vols. For an opportunity here. Sent over. Love it again. My goodness, how fun it is to watch number six, Erica Lovett, play volleyball. She is having herself a day. Skies for the kill here. You can tell she's filling it back there, really enjoying some early Saturday volleyball. Our folks stay sent over, blocked nicely by Tennessee. They'll send it back. Boot this time, try to tip it over. Nice dig out by Norfolk State and Rodriguez. A tap here. Kill sent sky high, almost touches the jumbotron here in Thompson Bowling. Rodriguez on the deck once again. Fingal. Now Norfolk State, good rally here and a point for the Lady Spartans. Adeline Deja for this time. What a nice hustle play. We have seen Nicole Rodriguez get all over the deck this afternoon. And this one sent right back over by DeFour. Norfolk State trying to hang on. 
This one sent over a nice serve there by Hunter. She'll dig this one out. Norfolk State looking for another point, and they'll get one. Back-to-back -back points for the girls in green and yellow. Good luck here. Just sent right over by Norfolk State. Quickly two in a row. They've trimmed down that set two lead to five. Look at this serve. Just a lot of movement on that volleyball. This one's sent over and right to me. Bingle able to get in on the block. Tennessee a year ago, 3.01 blocks per set last season. They led the SEC, ranked second nationally. And they will serve here. Ashlyn King this time. Sent across the net, and that one goes wide for Norfolk State. Carla Hernandez sending that one out of bounds. Mentioned Ashlyn King making the move over from Murfreesboro. Did not play a season ago. Takes a short drive over here to Knoxville in the lineup here today. That one skying for the kill it is Morgan Fingal once more. Just impressive on how high Fingal can get on this one. Sends it right at Norfolk State's defense. Tennessee quickly up eight, seven points away from a set two win. Cross court, tapped over, pancake block. I believe it was Hayward that time. Norfolk State blocked again, but out of bounds. Check out Hayward. She's able to just dive under that one, get the pancake block. And then the block unable to be made by Lovett. Point Norfolk State. <laughs> Sit up, love it that time, and unable to dig that one out. <laughs> Kyla Hunter. Love it, another point on the afternoon. Now up to at nine kills. Hitting percentage of 533. Six digs for Lovett. She's been all over the court for Tennessee. Service error on Tennessee. It's Paolo Laborda this time. And now Matos to send it over for Norfolk State. Tough dig there from the libero. And Laborda point, Norfolk State trying to creep back into this one. Norfolk State a year ago, 8-18 eight and 18 overall. They were good for 4-10 and 10 in the MEAC. That was 6th in the MEAC, the Mid-Eastern Athletic Conference. They lost seven players from that 2021 team. Most games won in a season since 2013, and a block at the net. And you guessed it, Erica Lovett once more. How big it is to get Lovett from Long Beach State and into this program from Eve, Eve Rackham Watt. She's extended to February of 2026, that the contract of Rackham Watt. She comes over from North Carolina here in her fifth season. As an ace sent over from Fingal, she's having herself a match as well. Seems like her nose is okay after taking one right off of it earlier in the set. 
Angel sending this one across the net. Another nice serve. Back-to-back -back aces from Fingal. Tennessee. Tennessee over there at their bench. Loving the serves from Fingal. Unable to be dug out by Rodriguez. Tennessee quickly approaching a set two win. Fingal, oh, that one creeps over, my goodness. She gives a grin over here and she is loving it. Everything going right for Tennessee here in this one. Fingal hits the top of the net. It takes a hard left-hand turn and a quick timeout on the floor. Tennessee leads 23-13 here in set two. The grin of Morgan Fingal. Welcome you back into Rocky Top here on the SEC Network Plus and the ESPN app. Tennessee two points away from a set two win, looking to go up two sets to none here in their first matchup of the 2022 Rocky Top Classic here on Saturday. Tennessee looking to get two quick victories in the Classic. Fingal having a blast back there serving three straight aces, and she'll send another one over. This one a little bit more manageable for Norfolk State. This one's sent over. Up top, block is made. Tennessee, it's time. Blocked again at the net. Norfolk State showing the net presence, but then that one's sent over. And Point Tennessee, they're one point away from a set two win. And yep, it's Love It again. Tennessee, the trio of Fingal, Love It, and Hayward. Really nice to see. Tough dig out there by McCray over and point Norfolk State. They're not out of set two just yet. Yes. Norfolk State trying to battle here. Nice job from the backside and the kill for the Lady Spartans. Over top and we've got a whistle. Point will go to Norfolk State. After the net violation by Tennessee. This one sent over a nice serve from Hernandez. Sent over again, Norfolk State. Three straight points here in the second set. The combination of Hernandez and McCray, check that, McCray and Maraday at the net. Three straight from the kids in green. That one's sent up and out of play. Make it four in a row after the ace from Norfolk State. It's Carla Hernandez. 
That one breaking straight down to the floor, unable to dig that out as Claudia Pollock. Tennessee trying to find that last point of the set. Up top, love it, tips it over. And once again, Tennessee and Erica love it. Get it done here in set number two. Tennessee takes a quick two set to nothing lead. We will move to set number three here on Rocky Top. Join you with you here in set number three inside of Thompson Bowling Arena. Tennessee quickly with a two set to none lead over the Norfolk State Lady Spartans. Tennessee winning set one 25 12 and set two 25 17. Norfolk State will serve here to begin set number three. And it's Sydney McCray sending this over and an ace from Norfolk State quickly. They're on a rainy Saturday in Knoxville. Day two of the Rocky Top Classic. Boots sends this one over. Blocked nicely by Norfolk State. Hayward this time. And she will get the point. Tennessee quickly knots it up at one apiece. I'd be felt if I didn't mention this being a college football Saturday. Both matchups for the football programs on each side. Tennessee over at Pittsburgh today. 3.30 kickoff against the Pitt Panthers. And Norfolk State gets their first opportunity at a Division I team. As that one is blocked at the net, it is Fingal once again. Tennessee quickly up two, game, two, two points to one, I should say. 
As that one's sitting back over the net. Norfolk State football program over at James Madison today. A 4 o'clock first kick. Both games here on the ESPN app. Lovett digs that one out nicely. Back across and Norfolk State with a free point. And that one back across for Booth. Tennessee with the point. Looking to quickly attack. We'll send Hayward back to serve. Back-to-back -back seasons in the top five in the SEC and EP in APS. Also on the floor. And Point Tennessee. They'll send Hayward back once more. That one blocked at the net. The combination of Cadence Booth and number 19, Claudia Pollock this time. A beautiful job. Check that. It's just Booth all by herself. And Norfolk State with the point. Tennessee up 4-2. Now went off the right foot of Sydney McRae. Point Tennessee. And it's Morgan Fingal once more. Bingle now with nine kills on the afternoon. Cadence Boot, the freshman, to send it across. That one dug out. It's the libero. Laborda this time. Love it. Unable to make that one click. And point Norfolk State. New libero into the game for Norfolk State. And right as I say that, she checks out in Hernandez. Laborda couldn't get to that one. And Alondra Hernandez, the junior from Provo, Utah, transfer from Central Washington. Served that one over. She digs that one out. And a nice dig there by Boo, trying to keep it alive. And Norfolk State will get the point. Lady Spartans trying to hang around. They did so in set number two. They tied it up at five points apiece. Then quickly, six straight points from the Lady Vols as Hayward was serving. Really helped them gain the momentum a set ago. So an up top. Love it. What a dig. My goodness. Alondra Hernandez. Tennessee looking to capitalize on the point. They can't do so. That one blocked at the net once more. And you guessed it. Erica love it. Check out this dig from our high up top cam. <laughs> Just sends the left leg out there. Alondra Hernandez able to keep it in play. Tennessee wins the point though. And they took a 6 point to 4 lead here in set number three. Up top, sent over by Tennessee. Norfolk State looking to capitalize, unable to dig that one out is Natalie Hayward. And it's a 6-5 Tennessee lead. Iola Matzos back to serve for Norfolk State. As I mentioned, member of the Puerto Rican under-18 national team. A junior from Ferro, Puerto Rico. And that one is killed by Tennessee. Erica Lovett, she is on double-double watch here in this one. 11 kills, make it 12. Now up to eight digs. Oh 
Fingal to serve. A master class of a server is Morgan Fingal, but Norfolk State will get an opportunity. Booth digs it out. A flurry of action at the net. And yep, Tennessee touched it three times. Point, Norfolk State. Got to mention what Kathy Bullock is trying to do here at Norfolk State here in her fourth season. Lady Spartans trying to turn this program around. Coach Bullock led this team to eight wins in 2021. The program's most since 2013. And that one is dug out by Carla Hernandez. Back the other way, it's Cadence Booth. And that one's sent back. Love it. Is that one in? It is not. Norfolk State awarded the point. And just like that, we're knotted up at seven, and Tennessee would like to take a timeout. Lady Spartans hanging around here in set number three. We're tied up at seven here in the Rocky Top Classic. We bring you back in here to Knoxville, Tennessee. We resume set number three as it is tied up at seven apiece. Norfolk State looking to steal a set from Tennessee here in set three. And they will get to serve. Coming out of the timeout by Tennessee and head coach Eve Rackham Watt. Carla Hernandez, the graduate from Puerto Rico, sends this one over and that's an ace for Hernandez. Norfolk State takes the lead once again here in set number three. Substitution on the floor. Cadence Booth checks out for Tennessee and Ashlyn King right back into the match for the Lady Vols. That one and that's a service error on Hernandez. Knotted right back up at eight apiece. Again, I want to thank you all for joining us here on the SEC Network Plus and the ESPN app. For our producer, Stacia Patterson, director, Hunter Milkey. I am Zach Nelson. It's been a pleasure to be along with you here in game number one. That one stays on the Norfolk side, and they'll get the point. Good look from our net camera. That one hits the post. Our folks state back in front. That one blocked at the net. Two straight points from the Lady Spartans. Their bench down to my right really starting to fill it here in set three. And that time, it's number one, Sydney McRae. Yeah, 
Hayward, Fingal, Point, Tennessee. That combination has been fun to watch today. A nice assist there from Hayward. And Tennessee cashes in on the opportunity. Now down one here in the set. Ja'Kaya Moore will check in for Tennessee and serve here. And serves that one right into the net. And just like that, she'll check out. Granberry back into the contest as well as Paola Laborda. McCray to serve. That one tipped around at the net, and Norfolk State has got some momentum. Nice job here by the Lady Spartans. Getting a little excited on that away side. And that's another ace. Norfolk State, Sydney McCray on the ace. Norfolk State, their largest lead of the contest now at four. Replay comes in, hits the top of the net. And another point for Norfolk State. That one's sent over and right there, Morgan Fingal once again. Fingal with her 11th kill on the day to go along with three blocks. Tennessee trying to change that momentum over to their side as Hayward will send it across. Free ball here for Tennessee. And out of bounds. Checking in quickly was Jasmine Brooks. It goes out of bounds and Norfolk State with the volleyball right back. It'll be Shantae Seal to serve. The senior out of Bridgetown, Barbados. Transfer from Decor Dakota College. As that one sent over a beautiful point there from Morgan Fingal. Decides to send it over herself. Tennessee trying to string together some points and get back in it here in set three. And that one sent to the deck. Pollock with the point. You can see Alondra Hernandez creep into your screen trying to get that right leg on it. Unable to do so. Tennessee within two. That one blocked at the net point. Tennessee three straight from the big orange. Erica Lovett on the block. Stat line for Erica Lovett, 12 kills, 9 digs, and 3 blocks. Tennessee within a point. Nice serve, but a nice dig there by Hernandez. Hingle taps that one over. That one looked like it was destined to go long. Tennessee keeps it alive. Hernandez dug out. Laborda, Fingal. Tennessee with an opportunity to tie it. And that one's sent away. Point Tennessee. Four straight for the Lady Vols. Tennessee trying to turn it on here in the third set. Take advantage of the momentum they have. Jasmine Brooks with the ace. Five straight for Tennessee. Brooks has back, been back there serving five straight points. Tennessee scored them all and will have a timeout on the floor. Tennessee on a quick 5 nothing run will step out and return a 15-14 lead here in set three for the Big Orange.
Back to the Rocky Top Classic. Tennessee with a burst of five straight points after the timeout by Norfolk State. And that one make it six straight. Norfolk State keeping it on their side. Tennessee has found something out of number 23, Jasmine Brooks. Brooks had only played seven sets coming into this contest. She's guided Tennessee to strict six straight points. Looking to make it seven here. Golden opportunity. Sit down to the deck once again. It's Claudia Pollock for Tennessee. Beautiful execution from the Lady Vols. Brooks sends it over once more. Norfolk State looking for a point. No, man, they will not get it. At the net, Morgan Fingal once again. Fingal now up to 13 kills and four blocks to go along with two digs here against the Lady Spartans. Brooks, filthy serve there, another ace, second ace. And now nine straight points from Tennessee. Tennessee looking to make it a clean ten straight. Fingal kept alive by the Lady Spartans. Dug out nicely by Brooks. That one off the net. And the 9-0 run has concluded by a point from Norfolk State. Jeremy's Norfolk State and a filthy one there. It's number 14, Alondra Hernandez. The transfer from Central Wyoming this time. This one just dies once it get uh, once it gets across the net, excuse me. Quickly two straight from the Lady Spartans looking to creep back into this one down just three. Love it. Dug out. And a net violation as Norfolk State unable to get that one across. Tennessee five points away from a match victory. And they'll send Granberry in and check out Claudia Pollock. And Paola Laborda will send it across. That one, another nice serve. Labordo with an ace for Tennessee. Lady Vols up five now here in set number three. Their largest lead here in set number three.
Trying to pick up something on the floor right here. Our referee. Looks like something might have came off the ceiling as they look to clean that up. Everything good to go. Tennessee looking for their fifth win here in 2022. They're four points away. That one dug out nicely. Natalie Hayward this time. Fingal dug out. Hernandez. That one stays in. Free ball point. Tennessee. Keandrea Granberry checks in, and her presence is immediately felt. Sends that one down hard. Tennessee three away from a win. Libero Laborda to serve once more. Up top, Laundra Hernandez. And the point will be awarded to Norfolk State. Norfolk State wants to stay in this one. They're going to have to start getting points now and in a hurry. Tennessee just three away from a match win. And Norfolk State with the opportunity to serve. It'll be Sierra Jones. Fingal. That one off of Norfolk State. Another kill for Morgan Fingal. She's up to 14 on the afternoon. Tennessee a couple away. Fingal now to serve. And it is fun to watch Seven and White serve. She sends it across. And an ace. Right on cue, Morgan Fingal. Tennessee is one away. Quite a few aces from the Lady Vols this afternoon. Tennessee looking for a 3-0 dub here in game number one of the afternoon. Morgan Fingal to serve. Dug out, Norfolk State. And a point, Lady Spartans. Trying to hang around. 24 to 18 lead for Tennessee. As Carla Hernandez to serve for Norfolk State. Love it. Hayward, love it again. Blocked at the net. That one sent over. Point Tennessee. And they get the win. Three sets to none. Tennessee a 25-12, 25-17, and 25-18 win here in match one on a Saturday afternoon. They'll do it again here at 6.30 against the Citadel. Thank you for joining us here on the SEC Network. For our technical directors, Tarek Bailey and Hunter Melke, our bug operators, Emma Coppenhaver and Kate Mulqueen, our camera operators, Perry Warner and Will Alwig, replay Barrett Walker, and our producer, Stacia Patterson. I'm Zach Nelson saying so long from Knoxville. Once again, our final score, three sets to none for Tennessee. To watch this entire game on replay as well as others on the SEC Network, download the ESPN app. This has been a presentation of ESPN the worldwide leader in sports.